Let's continue. Most commonly, people with anemia report feelings of weakness or tired, and sometimes poor concentration. They may also report shortness of breath on exertion. Exertion, I don't know how to say it. I'm not, I am not an American, so please excuse me. In, in very severe anemia, I mean in very severe anemia, the body may compensate for the lack of oxygen carrying capability of the blood by increasing cardiac output. The patient may have symptoms related to this, such as palpitations, angina, and all of these oh, things. So let me um, take your blood test first, though, um, because I have already listened to your heart earlier. There. Let's take your blood. bottom of this which I have already told you. There we go. You're not afraid of shots, are you? You're a strong boy. You're a man. That's the needle. Don't be afraid of needles. found in legumes. Legumes? I do not know how to say legumes. Huh. The funny nurse video for anemia. Uh, dried fruits and green leafy vegetables. It is also present in whole grains, especially if eaten in yeast bread. The yeast destroys the phytates. Sorry about my English. In the crane so that they cannot combine with the iron and sink and render them unavailable to the body. The 10 milligram of iron required daily in males is readily obtained in a vegetarian diet if a variety of foods high in iron is eaten. But the 10 milligram of iron required by females is much more difficult to obtain without the use of fortified foods. An iron deficiency anemia is frequently found in women throughout the world. <sighs> this may result from an inadequate intake of foods containing iron, the improper absorption of iron from the intestines or from an increased blood loss, the increased fiber and phytates in a vegetarian diet may also result in the decreased absorption of both iron and zinc from the intestines taking some vitamin C at the same time same meal increases the absorption of these two minerals and tends to counteract the action of the phytates. I will give you some vitamin C so you don't have to go to the pharmacy. I have it in my bag. Cooking in a cast iron pot will also increase your iron intake. Let me move the camera.
A recent study has shown that the iron nutritional status of uh, vegetarians and meat eaters is essentially the same. Vegans must be sure to eat foods with a high iron content every day. If this is not possible, they should take an iron supplement. Others who may need an iron supplement are infants, women that have an unusually heavy menstrual flow and women who are pregnant. So, I will re we'll read you more later. Um, I just do that because the doctor likes to charge more money. So, um, yeah, that's why he asked me to spend some more time with you. But shh, don't tell him, okay, that I told you so. Okay, this is from the book that I'm reading. I don't believe everything the book says, though. But that's some good information. So, let's take the blood. Where did I put the shot? There it is. Don't be afraid. I'm still experienced. You will know. You will soon be able to tell. Give me your arm. Oh, yes. Let's pull it. Oh, you did great. You get a kiss for that. I love you. You're one of my best patients. And I'll talk to you again soon. Call me at any time, day or night.